everyone. Welcome to our middle school winter band concert. My name is Mr. Chapa, and I serve as the middle school band director here. And tonight, you're going to have an evening filled with all things band. As a friendly reminder, please refrain from using flash photography and moving up from your seat while music is being performed. Please refrain from distracting musicians while they're on stage and applaud at the appropriate times. You'll hear one of the songs is a jazz song tonight where you applaud after a solo. Our students worked very hard to prepare this music for you tonight, and we hope you enjoy the show. The first ensemble you hear is the grade six, seven, and eight combined beginning band. This is their first ever concert performance. Give them a big round of applause. Our next song is Beethoven's Jingle, which is a combination of Beethoven's famous theme, Ode to Joy, and the Gomos. Please enjoy. by Michael Camus. This song combines many of the performance techniques we learn as beginners in an exciting and memorable way. Thank you kindly for listening to our first performance as new wind band musicians.
saxophone. I am here to introduce to you the Grade 6 Combined Culture Band. During the regular school day, we met as two separate classes and have combined for this special performance tonight. To do this, we have to listen carefully to each other and develop a consistent rehearsal practice. Our first song is Uskadar by Robert Smith and Michael Story. Uskadar is a pop popular Turkish song named after an important town in Middle Eastern culture and history. Please enjoy. by Brian Bauman. This song reflects a late night adventure where someone is sneaking around. It is a fun piece that helped us practice different articulation and dynamics. Please enjoy.
Our next song is A Prehistoric Suite by Paul Jennings. A suite contains many different movements. This is a programmatic work, which means that each movement draws a, on graphic images for inspiration. In this case, dinosaurs. You will hear a proud stegosaurus, a soaring pterodactyl, and a battle between a T-Rex and a Triceratops. Please enjoy. But this famous English castle was used as the set for Hogwarts and the Harry Potter movies. This song has many dynamics, contrasts, which make it exciting to play. Please enjoy. Oh, 
school wind ensemble. The middle school wind ensemble is an auditioned ensemble composed of seventh and eighth grade students who want to perform challenging wind band music. Having just finished our family week concert, we had only three practices to prepare a new song we are happy to share with you this evening. Santa Claus is Coming to Town, arranged by Michael Camus, is a classic holiday song set in a jazz big band style. We enjoyed learning a new style of articulation in this setting, and we hope you enjoy our performance. Thank you. Here to introduce our final song, Majestia, by James Sirenjian. Majestia is a powerful work with multiple dramatic contrasts. At times, this piece is mysterious and awe-inspiring. At others, it is bold and courageous. And at others, it depicts gentle beauty. The challenge for us was to learn how to perform each section convincingly while connecting the transitions between them seamlessly. Please enjoy Majestia.
my pleasure to introduce the combined grade seven and eight concert band. Just like the other combined groups, this band normally meets as two separate classes and have combined for this special performance tonight. This and the song you just heard was Sky Gets a Fanfare by Randall Standridge. Our next song will be Afro Blue by Mong Ong Stan and Santa Maria. Afro Blue is a jazz standard written by in a Afro-Cuban style. There are also multiple solos in the middle of this piece. It is good manners to clap and cheer for the soloists after they finish when performing jazz music. We hope you enjoy. Thank you.
with some data that's lying in my notes. Um, just want to say a couple final remarks before we wrap things up. First of all, I want to brag a little bit about how wonderful all of these young musicians are. Uh, I want to also express my gratitude um, and my heartfelt thanks to some people who made tonight's performance possible. This year, I started an after-school practice program for students, and that allows them to stay for 30 minutes after school, which doesn't seem like that long, but it gives them a chance to have some private study, and it makes your neighbors maybe not so angry at you. <laughs> we had tremendous success with this. It was no way mandatory. We had over 140 instances of students signing up to take advantage of this opportunity. This amounts to roughly three solid days, 72 hours of extra practice time. If any of you students came to an after school uh, optional practice, can you please stand up and be recognized? Now on to some thank yous. First, I want to thank all the teacher volunteers who helped manage things behind the scenes tonight. I want to thank the middle school ambassadors for welcoming our audience so warmly and kindly. I also want to formally thank my good friend up in the booth, Mr. Ben Dingle, for managing our lights tonight. I also want to thank Mr. Paul Detroit and his students for organizing a recording of this. That's no way mandatory, and I really appreciate your efforts making that for us. I also have to thank um, especially Liz and Jin. They are uh, two members of our, of our event support staff, and they do a lot of things behind the school for us. So thank you, Liz and Jin, for your help. <laughs> Lastly, we got some important people in here. I want to thank our head of school, Mr. Sean Bento. I saw you earlier. Thank you, Mr. Bento, for being here and supporting us. And our two principals, Mr. Patrick Carroll and Mr. Paul Boland. Their support is so valued in so many ways behind the scenes, on and off the stage. So thank you so much. <laughs> Last one is cheesy. It's for you students. I'm not going to cry. You should know how proud I am of you. And how much I appreciate your kindness and your enthusiasm for what we do together. You're a part of something very special, and I hope that you take the time to reflect on that and think about it, and also celebrate how wonderful it is that we get to make music together. So thank you from me. And uh, the person who would, who would never draw attention to himself who has done so much work to make this happen, who has really, really grown this program um, throughout the years he's been here. Uh, the kids love him, the teachers love to work with him. Mr. Chapa, thank you so much.
That's all. Thank you so much for coming. Have a wonderful holiday. And make sure, parents and students, you have a good dinner tonight. Thank you very much for coming. Have a wonderful evening. Bye-bye.